get my third of 4 AP tests down. No, 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 go ahead. No, no, I'm good. Do you know what's going on out there? These are not burned at all. <laughs> all the same. <laughs> Katie, you're well, folding your laundry. I'm just, yes, my room is kind of a mess. I'm very so. proud of you. I know you're going to be redoing your room, well, but yeah. I think you okay. should um, okay. 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 No, yeah. Um, let me, can I just... I'll okay. 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 Okay, bye. Oh, no, no, go ahead. No, 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 no okay, okay. I was room. thinking that the mirror, I know you wanted to hang it, it shouldn't go here because that can't open all the way. What if we move these hooks over there and put your mirror here? Would that be better? Or do you... Or do you want it on the outside of your door? Hmm. Outside of my door? Would that work? That would work, right? It would totally work. But then I couldn't. But then if it, I would have to stand like up against my... Unless my bed was there. Mm -hmm. So maybe we should just bring it in. We should just bring it in and let... Okay. Yeah, so don't attach it yet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and there. move it there and then your TV's still there and it'll still be like... Oh, you right. 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 right, right, right. So here's the thing. What? We just need to figure that out. Okay, we, we can do that. And this is a, this is a mess. It is, but it I is love mess. that you're putting it back together. Thank you, uh, thank you, my sweet girl. <laughs> Okay, good. Okay. All right, you need anything else? I'm, I'm okay, thank you. Okay, adios. Okay, bye. Today has been an awesomely productive day so far. I did spend way too much time in the Home Depot, but, um, you know, when we came home from Florida, I know we keep talking about coming home from Florida, but it was just such an uh, impressionable time. Um, you know, I had all of these home projects on my list anyway that I'm pretty sure I've told you about that I wanted to do. So now is the time to get those done and I've been checking them off one by one. When I get home, I'll show you my closet because I think my carpet came in and I think, and I just got a mirror from Target for my closet. So I'm gonna hang that up, put out the carpet and then I think my closet will be almost done. Hold on, the light just changed, stay tuned. Okay, I'm back, what was I saying? I think I was talking about being in Florida and all of the home projects that I wanted to do with it. Now I'm getting done. Also, I have to add that my mom was such an inspiration, always is such an inspiration in so many different ways, but one of them is the way that she keeps her house so clean and organized and clutter-free. And I have this desire to like to keep things. I don't like to get rid of things because what if I might need it later? I think I'm always afraid that I'm I'm not gonna have money to buy it, like if I need it. But that's the thing, once you buy something once, you don't wanna buy it again. and things aren't disposable, you know? So I feel like, you know, if I bought a lint roller, I'm gonna keep that lint roller forever. <laughs> I'm not gonna throw it away because it's clutter and buy a new one when I want it. So anyway, that's an example. So um, Mike is very much a get rid of everything kind of guy. I'm very much a keep it and find a good space for it kind of gal. So I bought lots of things today. Let's <laughs> see, so I'm filling my house up again. No, 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 it's for organization. Um, this mirror, one key, I want to put a mirror in our bed in our uh, bedroom closet and Katie needs a new one too because hers is broken and then I bought a lot of like um, storage items you see here like boxes and that kind of stuff and then back here is my wood and all my cuts for my new wine rack which I'm so excited about so I'm gonna take all this stuff in and I think the kiddos are in there we'll see what what's going on and I will bring you along as I make my wine rack I do not see a box out here with my carpet but I have a feeling that maybe if it was delivered they brought it inside so stay tuned I will keep you informed of what's going on and you can come with me while we um transform our teeny tiny house It's gonna be even more fluffy once it sits here for a little bit. But Michael, I think this is making a difference. I got one thing left to do in this closet. Oh my gosh, it feels so good on my PDs. Okay, that looks pretty good, right? Mm-hmm. That makes a difference. Yeah. Should I go more down this way? You gonna put some carpet uh, tacky yeah. stuff down? Yeah, I'm gonna have to get some moving around. What do you think? Should I go down here? Probably right in the middle, like that. That's good, right? Looks great. Um, and so what I'm going to do is down here, I'm going to put wallpaper on this wall, poke it up, wallpaper, and then it will be done. I'm so excited. Wouldn't that be nice? Fantastic. 
white wallpaper where I'm trying to get silver polka dots. And I just found some online. But now I got a wallpaper that wall. Duh. Then this will be like a dream closet. Mm. Yeah. Can yeah. you, can, Michael, how different is this from the closet we had before? Very different. Is that all you have to say? Very different. Really? It's like light years different. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't, you're not, not on your shoes. Take your shoes. <laughs> Do not walk on this with your shoes. Here, you can get back. Go ahead. <laughs> Go out. <laughs> Thank you. Good job, Aim. Okay. Nice work. All right, there sits Brennan. That's where he took his AP exam. Three down, one to go. How exciting. Okay. Yes. <laughs> He's very focused right now, so we won't interrupt him. But I will uh, brag on him for a minute. So he already took a AP US history exam on Friday, I think. Yesterday was AP English literature and communication. Something starts with a C, I can't remember. English language and composition. Ling language and composition. And today was AP World History. Tomorrow is his last AP exam and then he'll be finished. And that is going to be AP Statistics. My lunch. <laughs> Ryan. Hi. When are we um, going to get that mop off of your head? Um, yeah. Whenever dad forces me to. Can we have another puzzle? I know I saw Yes, I saw, I went to Target today, they didn't have any. So go online, go to, once you're finished your no, homework, I, go to I'm Amazon and tell me which one to order it, okay? Okay. Cool. All right, very good. Yes, it is puzzle time, I think. Hello. What you doing? <laughs> I'm checking out what you're doing. Who is the noise in here? Huh? Are there people outside talking? Yeah, there's people outside. Oh, that's so cute. What are you doing? They've been talking for a while. Oh, are they in our yard? Is it the lady? Guess why? Guess why? I know. Is it the lady with the baby on the front? Yes, I know. Do you know what's going on out there? Do you know what's going on? You, you opened my window. I've heard of there's Should like we a, tell them? There's like a nest or something. You guys, in, okay, okay, there's, okay, in the property next to us, there's this huge dead tree that we kind of want to go away, but actually now it's kind of cool. This, this little, um, woodpecker has made a little hole like a little house inside there and he laid his little baby well she i guess laid her little babies so there's Aww. a woodpecker that hangs out with a little red head and the babies are all inside and i didn't even notice it because i've been so busy and we haven't been here but today i was outside in the yard and this lady was walking by who i don't know she must be a new neighbor anyway she was walking by and she said hey have you seen the babies she's been by like three times now anyway there's babies in there so hold on let me see if i can zoom in wait i'll show you guys hold on Oh, persnickety, Brennan. These are not burnt at all. <laughs> oh my gosh, aren't you guys? So we had people over the other night and Mike grilled chicken. So, and Brennan, what do you think about that? He, he, <laughs> he think, would say it's good if it's not burnt. It's bad. Those, those are not burnt. <laughs> Mike thinks we're being persnickety. They're oh, very Brennan. well done. <laughs> oh yeah, those okay. Would well you guys, okay, I'm gonna put up a poll. Would you guys eat this chicken? Question mark, question mark. I don't mind telling you, we are so... Eat the chicken. I did. We are very not into wasting food. At least Mike and I are. The kids would never eat that. But Mike and I do not waste food. And we pinch our pennies and everything. <laughs> exactly. And I literally, I've had, since you've been gone, I've had like four pieces of chicken. I've had at least one every day because I can't even cut it. <laughs> <laughs> I put out to microwave it a little bit, make it soft, and then I mix it in my salad so I don't taste it. Do you think, do you <laughs> think our guests... Uh, yeah, I don't think they did actually. <laughs> and the hamburgers were raw. Did you notice that? Sure, the yeah. hamburgers that you, that you cook, you might not be the best griller, honey. Your special, on your special graduation day, you're, you're so... better at other things. That's, you know what Morgan said? Really not that bad. You know what Morgan said to her mom? She goes, she goes, mom, you know, we come over here all the time, and Miss Jill makes really, really good food. I mean, tonight was okay, but like she, like this is not <laughs> an example of well. Next time I'm taking over the grill, Michael. That's it. Okay, that's so gross. <laughs>
close to assembly, which I'm pretty excited about. I have to say it's a, it's a fairly easy project, but it's definitely one that took a lot of thinking, like, because there's a little, there's kind of a lot of parts to it and I want it to be flush to the cabinets on the wall. So that's took, as my dad would say, a little ciphering. Ciphering is like, is like calculations. I would, I would cipher in my head, which is like calculations. So anyway, um, I'm finishing this up. Katie is with her friends, Sophia and Kyla, and they went over, I think to Kyla's house, but they're gonna sleep over here tonight. So they'll be back soon. Brennan is over at his friend's house and he will be back soon. Ryan is downstairs playing Fortnite, I think, with like 10 of his friends. Not here, but his friends are all on, I don't know what you call it, like, I don't know how you, what you say, what, what you call it, but like they're all at their own houses playing um, Fortnite, but they're kind of doing it all together so they can see each other or something. I don't know how that works, but I'm old fashioned. Anyway, so he's doing that. He's been screaming downstairs for about the past three hours. We got it, we got it. <laughs> anyway. So I'm gonna wrap up. Let me just show you really quickly what I've got going here. So this is the panel that goes on the one side. These are the um, shelf holders uh, for the other side. This is some trim that's gonna go on the front. This is also some trim that's gonna go on the front. And this is, well, you can't really see. I, I put one of the uh, shelf holders right there. But anyway, that's all we have so far, but tomorrow I'll put it together. Hopefully I, I would love to be finished tomorrow. That would be so fantastic. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed today. We had Kyla and Sophia, Katie's friends over for dinner. So we had a nice dinner today, but we didn't film it because we just wanted to hang out. There's, there he is. How many people are playing, Ryan? Oh, for real? Mm -hmm. oh. How, how many people are playing? Uh, five of us. Five of you. Excellent. Yeah. How you doing? Great. Excellent. Do you want to share what made you happy? Uh, Matthew's a little bit sorry. Like. Oh, sorry, Matthew. <laughs> she said. She said sorry. <laughs> oh, are you still? Are you still there? It's like you're in a. Why are you in a bowling alley? Because there's a bowling mode. All right. Are you sure it made that you Uh, yeah, what made me happy today was just getting on with the boys, and uh, I finished two of my school subjects today. Um, yo, boys, what made you happy? Oh, yeah, and we played spike ball on a floor. Oh, yeah. Did you, tell, did you tell everybody about that? Um, I can't remember if he did. Yeah, I think, I think Ryan oh, told you about that. Too, they played spike ball on a floating dock, like out in the middle of the water, like it's just a floating dock, and then they played spike ball, so when they were, went to get for yo, the ball, boys, they would jump off the, <laughs> off, the, um, off the dock, which was really cool. All right, so what made me happy today was getting all uh, two, well, lots of things, but of course, everything makes me happy, but um, getting all my stuff, um, my Maison Plan, my stuff together for the, um, for the wine rack. I'm pretty jazzed about that. Once that's done, I'm moving on to the big dining room project, which is going to be that wall over there. I think I've talked about that with you guys before, but getting this done is going to be awesome. I'm so excited about it. So getting everything, like the measurements and getting all the wood cut and painted and, and ready for assembly tomorrow made me happy. And having Katie's friends over for dinner. We had a nice dinner that made me happy too. And I got some new lights for the front and they are glowing. Oh! I'm so excited. When I bought them, I didn't realize they were gonna make that star pattern. But isn't that nice? I'm so excited about that. Okay, anywho. All right, so comment below what made you guys happy today. We hope you have a wonderful day. And we can't wait to hear about all the things uh, that you talk about that you're doing. So thank you so much for being you. We really appreciate you guys um, so much. You, I, I hope that you know that. <laughs> Just know that every Friday at five o'clock Eastern, we go live, we go do a live stream. So please jump on. Um, we get pretty interactive and try to read as many comments as we can and respond if we can as well. So also another thing is we have joined Cameo. Cameo is an app that um, we can do shout outs. So look up Brandon, Ryan, Katie, and I are on it. Mike is not on it, but if you guys want Mike to be on it, please comment below and we will get him on Cameo. So that's been a fun thing for us to do as well to um, connect with you guys in that way. Made me happy today. Get my third of four AP tests down. Uh, good. I thought my DBQ was pretty good. Oh, I want you to read it to me. Tell them what the topic was. It was about um, 
Industrialization. Industrialization from 1800 to 1900 and... Um, in non-Western. Yeah, yeah non-Western. The, how the industrialization of non-Western elites differed. Tough question. But, <laughs> uh, I got some good documents. Okay. So... Thanks for watching, guys. Hope I made you guys happy today, and hopefully we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.